Hey there. Today we're going to talk about regions. So in our map editor, you can add regions by clicking on our region icon. And you can assign different regions by click and dragging. Um, you can name your region. So uh, I'm going to call it in for now. Um, and create. All right. So now you can see that I've created the region. And let's uh, set this carpet as our out region. So we're going to create another region. And we're going to call it out. All right. So region set. And regions are great. So um, because you can move units or uh, add different types of mechanics uh, in games. So just to quickly show you how it would work. Um, I'm going to create a new script and I'll call it in and we'll call it when unit when a unit enters region. Okay. And we're going to add a new action. So when a unit enters a region, um, we're going to move that unit or We'll do an if statement first, and we're going to compare the region to make sure that we're talking about the right region. Um, so if the triggering region is same as in, all right, um, we're going to move the unit. Move unit. Yes. So we're going to move the, uh, the triggering unit to a random position in a region out all right so what's gonna happen i'm gonna just whoops yeah it seems like a bug i'm gonna have to fix this right away when a unit which enters the region okay so when unit enters to enters into the uh in region uh we're gonna move that unit to out region um so when the unit goes in here he's gonna end up into the in the in the carpet region so let's see how that works out. I'm going to go ahead and publish the game. All right, so now we're going to move our unit to the region that we created. And as you can see, uh, it moves the unit uh, right into right on the carpet. Let's try that one more time. Now move into in region. And yes, you are moved in onto the carpet right away. So this feature could be used in many applications. So for example, uh, we have a we have a soccer game um, where we have different regions where we can uh, decide to where to spawn the unit. So this, these are uh, where the units will start different teams, right? And then we have the the goal post uh, where it's going to detect the the ball unit going in, and then we can assign scores, give scores to uh, uh, the to the team that's scoring. Regions could be used for more complex games. For example, we, I have this another game uh, made called uh, Arena, uh, where you can go to a certain location to make bets. So you can see that uh, there's lots of regions here where people can walk into to make bets. So yeah, that is the basics of the regions. And that's it. Thanks for watching, guys.